Hi guys, I'm back again. We're gonna go through the chords for the key of G. Okay, so there's a couple, I'll show you a couple of G's here. The one that you've seen in other videos, this one, this one and this, so that's, you're on the E string with your little finger, B strings are on the third fret there. You're gonna reach up to the third fret on the uh, large E string, and then you're gonna to go to the second fret on the A string. Now that there, you can play a G without the little finger. Some people do that. I like the sound of this G. And then the other thing you can do is, is play the G like this, a little finger here. And uh, so there you go. Okay, and I'll show you why that works later, but that's, that's uh, how you can play a G chord. You can also play a bar G. If you looked in the, the dreaded F video. So there's a G chord. Okay, and there's the bar G, barred. Okay, if you want more details on that, go back to the dreaded F and you'll see that. Okay, so there's your G. Now you need a C. So we're gonna go down here, we're gonna go to the B string, first fret. Then we're going to skip a string and go to the D string second fret and then we're going to go to the um, A string third fret. Now you can play a C like this also. Get that little fuller sound. Most of the time people play it like this but this is a, this is a nice option too. So if I went back to a G uh, from a C position, it's, it's much easier just to go from here to here. And then drop that back down. So that makes it really easy for going from G to C. Or you could go back to this one. And then of course you have your D chord. That's uh, three major chords in the key of G. Just for the fun of it. All right, there you go.